How are you guys? Um, I know it's been a little while since I've seen you guys, but I wanted to come on here and do finally do my Christmas, what I got for Christmas video. I know that was like a month ago, but I still have everything like packed up in boxes and everything and I need to get everything sorted out and out of the way. So I figured I'd just come on here and get it done so I can get all this stuff put away. Um, it's going to be a long video. I just have to tell you guys that I have to be honest with you. I got a lot of stuff this year. Um, well I do every year, but this year was like an overload of stuff. So, um, I got everything from makeup to clothes to just a bunch of stuff. So, um, I am going to, uh, post some pictures. I'm going to try and post them above as I speak of some of the items that you guys can see, um, still shots of. Um, and also at the end of the video, I'll post some, um, uh, pictures. Um, so I'm either going to put them in or at the end, whatever. However I do them, I'm going to post some pictures. And also there's some items that I'll post pictures of that I'm not going to show you in here because it might be clothes that I wore and they're in the dirty laundry or something like that. So that being said, let's jump straight into this video because it's going to be a long drawn out video. Um, okay. So first and foremost, I don't know if you guys know the movie Bride of Chucky. I'm sure you guys all do. I'm absolutely diehard in love with all the Chucky movies, but the Bride of Chucky was like one of my favorites. I absolutely loved, loved, loved that movie. So, um, that being said, hubby got me these amazing things from the Bride of Chucky movie. So he got me my Chucky doll, which I've been already took them out and been playing with them. I'm going to be posting these in my diva room on my couch. I have a leather couch in there, a black leather couch. So I thought these would be like a great addition just sitting there. So I'm going to take him out. I've been kind of seeing how Sophie feels about him and she hates him. So um, I was a little bit like blown back at the artist job I mean I think it's cool but I think they probably could have did a little bit of a better job but it is pretty awesome um as you see his neck is like elongated but I think that's because he does move his neck so I think um that's why they did that but hi I'm Captain wanna play now the first thing we gotta do is get me out of this body once <laughs> and for all he's says a lot of stuff but um he has his little knife and stuff like that so I thought he was so adorable look at him He's so cute. And look, his, his clothes are even torn. Um, this was purposefully do, done, you guys, so you guys don't think I ripped or anything. Um, and then he got some, like, cuts in his knees from, you know, <clears throat> just being rough and everything else. So I absolutely love him. Um, he's my baby. This is my son. <laughs> but I'm going to be setting him on my couch in my diva room. So I got him. Uh-oh. Let me just put him over there. And then, of course, you can't have him without having his wife or he wouldn't be the bride of Chucky. So I got Tiffany. I was so excited when he got these for me, you guys. I've been wanting them, and I was so excited. Um, she has her little tattoo that says Chucky with a heart and then her little necklace and her little leather jacket. She even got them long nails. And her little leather jacket, her little boots, and wedding dress and veil. So, she's so cute. I love her. And she stands. She does not talk, although Chucky does. And Chucky sits. But she stands. So, what I'm going to do is sit him down and then stand her up next to him on my couch. I thought this would be so adorable. Oh, I love her. So, I was super excited to receive them. Um, hubby knows how much I love the Bride of Chucky. So, it was so sweet that... He went and found me these dolls and she is going to be a great and he also is going to be a great addition to my diva room <laughs> love them to death no not literally <laughs> oh and sorry you guys also she has her knife too her knife is in her boot she keeps her knife in her boot she's a diva like that he carries his in his hand. She carries hers in her boot. So that is them. And then also you guys, hubby got me a microphone for my camera. Um, those, most of you guys probably know, I think it was last year or the year before for Valentine's Day. I, excuse me, I got the Canon T6i um, camera, which I have not even filmed with yet. I know, horrible. 
and he got me a microphone to go with it although the microphone is pretty good on it it's better to have when you're like conferencing and stuff like that it's better to have like a um um external microphone um so he got me a microphone and it comes with the pouch to put it in and this is the mic and it just connects onto the camera like so so you unscrew the thing you slide this on there um, it already has the built-in shoe obviously and then you have your microphone so <clears throat> um, he was gonna get me the rod but I was doing a lot of like investigating with the rod and stuff which the rod is like $250 or something like that um, and <clears throat> there I seen a lot of comparison videos with this one and the rod and a lot of people were saying save the money and just buy this one because it's just as good um, or very, very close. So, and I like the sound of this one. I actually liked it better in some of the videos that people posted. I actually liked it better than the rod, to be honest with you. So, that's the one he got me. Oh, my leg. You guys, I pulled a muscle in the, the back of my calf. And it's very intense. Okay, so let's keep going. So, I'm just going to start with the clothing and shoes. And then I'll go into all the other stuff. So he also got me this Steve Madden backpack, which is absolutely gorgeous. I haven't used it yet. Actually, I think the paper's still in there. <laughs> yeah, the paper's even still in there. So, um, <clears throat> which is absolutely gorgeous. I love the pink and the black. And it just says Steve Madden up here. And then it has this little medallion that says Steve Madden. So I love it, you guys. I love to carry little backpacks around when I don't feel like carrying a purse. So this is great. Love it. Loves it. Okay. So he went crazy at Ashley Stewart. I mean, crazy. So um, he bought me a lot of purses. He bought me a lot of shoes and a lot of clothes. So as I said, I would try to leave some model pictures or still pictures, even if they're not on the model, above so you guys can kind of get an idea and better film. So, well, first, this didn't come from Ashley Stewart, obviously, but he bought me my Michael Kors purse also. I've been using this like every single day because I love the crossbody. It's easy to carry. Just put some stuff in here and it's just easy. Um, so I absolutely love this Michael Kors bag. So not sure where he bought it. Probably Michael Kors store. Um, okay, so this stuff now is coming to Ashley Stewart. So I'm going to show you. He bought me this purse here, which I think is so cute. It is so cute. And he left the tags on this stuff, um, a lot of this stuff, just in case I wanted to bring it back um, <clears throat> or change the color or the sizes or whatever. So I can pretty much tell you the prices of these. Um, <clears throat> well, I don't know what they are now, but I can tell you what they were when he got them Christmas time. So um, it's $24.50. And this one is really cute. It opens up and there's like two slots. So you can put your phone and stuff here and then put all your other things there. And it has these little curls on there wrapped in gold. And then you can either wear it as a wristlet or you can wear it as a crossbody, which I think is super cute. And then also he got me this purse which is a very cute one. I love this. You can put your hand in here and just carry it like this. Or it also comes with a strap and you can wear it as a crossbody or a sh uh, shoulder strap. And I love how deep this is. So it unzips up here and then it goes all the way down. Like this whole thing is the purse. And then it also has a pocket here, a button up pocket, and it just folds down. So this is super cute chic i love it absolutely love it and he said he could not resist <laughs> so he went ahead and bought me the pink one too they're calling this rose now when i show you the picture um the picture it looks like a white or off white or something like that or beige color but in person just to let you guys know it's like a pinkish color it's like a pearl pink it's really really pretty and it's the same concept so yeah he was like i couldn't choose between the two so i just got both <laughs> okay i'll do that i'll do that <laughs> and then he also got me this belt which i did wear 
and I love this belt love it it looks like this and you can wear it high-waisted and it is stretchy so if you're you know bigger than what it is and yeah so I love this belt also um the tags not on here oh just so you guys know these ones were $29.99 I'll tell you the prices of the ones that I still have tags on. <laughs> okay, I also got this outfit, which is crazy. He wanted me to wear this for Christmas um, if I wanted to. Obviously, he doesn't make me wear what I don't want to wear, but he thought it would be nice for me to wear it on Christmas. But I didn't end up wearing it because the glitter was falling off crazy. And I didn't want to have glitter all over everybody and all over everything. So I didn't wear it. So I'm going to give it a wash and then um, see if some of that problem stops. But I'm going to post a picture up here so you can see it on the model. And it is a skirt. You can pull it up to make it high rise. Or you can, um, which I have to pull it up because it's a little bit big. So I have to pull it up some, hike it up. Because the shirt will cover that. And you can make it more of a mini skirt than a longer skirt. And then it comes with this peplum. I want to say peplum. Is that, am I pronouncing it right? Shirt, which looks like this. Which is just... Yeah, <clears throat> that comes with it. Glitter, glitter, glitter. Yeah, see the glitter's all over everything. So he also got me this leather coat. Oh, is the tag still on this? I think I took the tags off of this, you guys. Yeah, I did. But I'll post the, um, as much information as I can. He also got me this leather jacket, which it zips up on to the side. And then in the back, it kind of got like a tail look. It's like tapered. But it has these two pockets in the front. It's really, really cute on. I'll show you guys a picture of that as well. But this kind of like folds over. And it zips to the side. It's really pretty. And at first I was like, baby, is that going to fit me? He was like, it's going to fit you. <laughs> then when I tried it on, it did fit. Okay, also he got me this shirt here. Wait, is the tag on the jacket? I might have took the tag off. I think I took it off when I tried it on. Oh, no, I didn't. It's right here. This is $59.99. And then also he got me this shirt. Which this thing like wraps around your neck and then like a choker almost. So you don't need to wear, you don't want to, you don't have to wear a necklace, but it's really cute. And then it kind of like tapers down on the sides. Like it's really pretty. And this one was $39.99. Now, I just want to tell you guys, if you guys never shopped at Ashley Stewart, Ashley Stewart is kind of pricey. Now, let me tell you, when she clearances her stuff, she goes way down. But at regular price, her stuff is kind of pricey. But I am telling you, it is so worth the price. Because when you go to other stores, a lot of times they shrink, they discolor, they tear, they, you know, stretch out, whatever they do. And you got to toss them out after a couple uses. With Ashley Stewart's clothes, they are so well made. You will have them for years. I have stuff in my closet from Ashley Stewart that I had for like over 10 years <clears throat> that I wore many times. So just trust me when I tell you it's worth every single penny. It's better than spending money to throw away when you can have the items for a long time to come. So anyway, he got me this shirt here. Did I say the price of this? Thirty-nine nine thirty-nine fifty. <clears throat> And that's the only reason why he left the tags on, you guys, is just in case I needed to take them back. Because sometimes the sizes don't run, um, they run differently with every item because the material is different. But anyway, this one was $39.50 also. And this looks like this. I will post a picture. It is so cute. You can wear it off the shoulder, on the shoulder. I've been wanting a plaid shirt for a long time. Um, and it has like this... I'll show you a picture because it looks better on the model than it does here, especially because it's wrinkled right now because they've been in this box since Christmas. Okay. Also, he got me this sweater, which I don't know if they call it cardigan sweater or whatever, but it is $59.50. And it's like this really long sweater and it has like the leather sleeves and then it's it's a big sweater. It's supposed to be like a flowy sweater and then it has a hood on it. So 
this is really really cute I really love this sweater really love it better get my uses out of it I should have been wearing it you know we've been having winter but um he also got me this purse which is like the little pink one oh, excuse me like this one but again he said he couldn't decide so and I'll show you why he got this specific one in this color but anyway um so he got me this little purse here and it, same concept love it wristlet or chain so really cute how much were these $24.50 he also got me this shirt which I will show you a picture and it's like one of them fl like flowy type shirts and it's very airy so this will be good like coming spring will be really really good um, for that because there's like a breeze and stuff this one was $39.50 and it has like the balloon type sleeves with the buttons it's so cute love this I'm setting this over here for a reason um also he got me this v-neck shirt which this one costed $39.50 now to be honest with you I think this is a little bit too pricey um for like a t-shirt um, although I know, like I said, it will last a long time. The colors won't fade. It'll be like a really long time type shirt, but still $39.50 for a shirt like this is not very, you know, worth it. But it got like the little things here. Um, so yeah, it's just a nice flowy shirt. And then lastly for the clothes, he got me this... New York shirt which I wish I kind of had this when I went to New York because it probably would have been perfect to wear it then but then again it was kind of warm out I don't know um anyway so this New York shirt and it has like the peaky boo shoulders so I will also show a picture of it on the model very cute I like it I like big flowy shirts you know and then this one also is one that's going to have to be shown on the model because it, it's kind of confusing. Um, did I even tell you the price of this one? This one was $39.50 also. And this one was also $39.50. It seems as if most of our shirts are $39.50. <laughs> so it looks like this. It's a big flowy shirt with a tie at the bottom. It's really cute. As I said, got to show you on the model. It looks better on the model. Um, it is like a see-through, so you do have to wear like a little um, shirt underneath. But that's cool. They keep you nice and cool in the spring. Um, okay, now I'm going to get into the shoes. He went crazy on some shoes, on some boots, guys. <laughs> but he did good. Okay, so he got me these boots here, which are like some olive green wedges. Which that's why I set this aside. He said that's why he got me this purse. It's not exactly the same, but it's like off. It's olive green. This is probably not even showing as olive green as it actually is in person. But anyway, so he ended up getting me this so I can wear with these boots. They're like wedge style. <clears throat> this comes to the knee. Very cute. And then for the big calf ladies, <clears throat> it got the stretch. And that's why I love Ashley Stewart. And I love shopping there personally myself. You know, because her clothes are true to size for big girls. It's not like, you know, if you go in a store, another store and you get a 2X or a 3X, sometimes it fits you like an extra large or a 1X. And um, it's not like true to size. But Ashley Stewart's clothes are going to be true to size, even her shoes. So that's why I love Ashley Stewart. And these will actually look really cute with like maybe this top or even this top here and some jeans or some stretch pants really cute like I can't wait <laughs> okay um also he got me these boots these actually did not come from Ashley Stewart but yeah I don't want to wear them right now I don't know because they're white and I'm kind of scared so um yeah he got me these boots um damn how much did them boots cost is there a price on them Probably not. Oh, $89.50 for these boots. And then 
these ones are 89.50, which I am in love with these. These will also go with this shirt or this shirt. And even if I want to wear this purse with it, I can. But look at these boots, you guys. Uh, they are so gorgeous. I took the paper off that was on here because I tried them on. But this also has the stretch back. That's what I love about her boots. They always have the stretch back for big calves. So, and I wear a 10. For those of you guys that don't know, I wear a 10. A 10 in. I absolutely have a big foot. Okay, also, oh, I'm trying to move because I have a lot more stuff. I also got these boots here. Yeah, he was like, I just thought these boots would look so beautiful on you. So, um, he loves this color on me. So, it's gorgeous suede feel. And then it has the heel, which is like plastic, I guess. And it's gold. And it's absolutely gorgeous. It is a booty. And you can tighten them at the ankles if you want. Or you could just wear them loose. So I like that option. It gives you a good option. And then last pair of shoes. Yeah, he went in. He got these in black. So I showed you the brown ones. These are in black. See, I didn't take the papers off this because I didn't try the black ones on because they're the same as the brown ones. And I figured if them fit me, why wouldn't the black ones fit me? They're the same boot. So he decided he didn't know if... I wanted black or if I want and you can always use a good black pair of boots so but he wanted me to have the brown also so he got me black and brown and same concept same price 89.99 89.50 sorry I don't know where they get the 50 from all the time it's like never really 99 it's always like 50 like 39.50 50 50 <laughs> like <laughs> okay but anywho that's all the boot stuff in the clothes so let me jump into the cosmetics. So he bought me five of these um, Deller Collagen uh, Mask, Collagen Mask. And these are so awesome. I actually used one. Um, I gave a pack to my daughter, so I only had four, but I gave a pack to her. Of course, I had to ask Hubby first because when somebody buys you something, you don't just give it away. But it's so cool. It comes with two of these masks. And then it comes with two sets of the eye mask, just in case you just want to do your eyes and not your whole face. And then it comes with two of the nose strips. So these are them gold um, patches. And then it also comes with ooh, an instruction booklet. So, yeah, I got a bunch of these. He was like, I know you like to do all your masks and all that stuff. So that was very nice. You guys, I was so... So excited to see this under the tree. Oh my gosh, I was so happy to see it. Look at this. Yes, I got the Morphe Holiday Collection palette. And oh my God, by far, this is one of their best palettes yet. It is absolutely stunning, absolutely pigmented. I had no problems out of this. I swatched it, I played in it. I've been messing with makeup all for the past month since Christmas. I've been like messing with makeup because I got so much. Um, but it also has the names on the paper, but look at this palette, you guys. Absolutely beautiful. Beautiful. And I love the eyeshadows. These are, um, whatchamacallit's, um, I forget. I forget what they're called. <laughs> but these are gorgeous colors, you guys. And I'm just going to swatch one because I'm going to have a mess. I'll swatch two. And just show you, just by touching it, how gorgeous and pigmented this palette is. If you don't have it, please go get it. And Morphe is very, very, very inexpensive um, compared to some of the top brands. And this is by far the best, like, of their line. I love this palette. I'm going to play, 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 play until it's gone. And they give you so much product in this palette, it'll last a long time. So I'm loving that. Forgot to put this back in there. I don't have time to be messing around up in here. Okay. We'll deal with this later. I <laughs> have too much stuff to go through. Um, okay. Now, Hubby got this bag for ordering from Ashley Stewart. This is Ashley Stewart on it. 
um he got that bag from from there but um i got this also now i'm used to buying the one large one um but i guess hubby was like just so i can try all the samples of the different colors so there's black there's gray there was a purple here and a gold here but i took the purple one out and and the brush that comes with it because i was playing in it and i forgot to put it back but um yeah so i got those now i picked this up myself I can't remember where I got it. You guys don't quote me, but I picked this up myself. Um, this is actually a cake stand, but I'm going to use this for storing some of my gorgeous bottles of perfume um, on this. And yeah, so it's cake stand and it says, um, I love you more than cake. And it has like this gold glittery heart. It's so pretty. I love it. I got this myself. Hubby didn't buy that. Well, he did, but he didn't. <laughs> he was with me when I picked it up and purchased it. Put it that way. I just threw that in there because I wanted y'all to see it. Um. Also, I picked this up. This is a double side edge brush and brow groom and smooth edge brush. And yes, you can use a toothbrush, but this is more denser and it has a little comb too, so you could do your little swoops or whatever. I grabbed this from the beauty supply. I think I paid like two dollars for it or something like that. I just had that thrown in here because. I need to put it away with all my makeup. Okay, and then the hubby got me this Betsy Johnson wallet. He's like, when I seen the pink sparkle, I just had to have it for you. <laughs> he loves my, that I love pink. He's like, you're such a girly girl. But um, the business cards and stuff like that go in here. You got your little change purse. You got your little wallet for your money or whatever you want to put in there. But it is Betsy Johnson. Let me see. It just says um, that the MSRP was $38, but I know he didn't pay $38. Otherwise, I wouldn't say manufacturer. Would, you know, that's basically. Okay, and I, I, I'm going to take the credit for this one because I picked this up myself. Um, I actually got two of them. The other one's in here somewhere. Here it is. Um, these are the LA Color High Shine, and these were $6 um, at Walgreens. And let me tell you guys, if you guys have never tried, oops, excuse me, if you guys have never tried their Shea Butter Lip Glosses, please go get them. They are by far my favorite cream lip glosses ever. I love them. So go get them if you can find them at Walgreens still. I'm not sure. I think this came out with Christmas, but you can, you possibly can find them. If you can't, I know some beauty supplies sell them singly because I know I bought one from a dollar store before. So, uh, or beauty supply, I can't remember, but it came as one, but they are so worth it. They're amazing. <clears throat> and then hubby also got me this palette here, which is Icon by Absolute New York. And it is in the color Exposed, and it is absolutely beautiful. Um, I'm not going to do too many swatches because this video is going to be even longer. So it does have a mirror, and then it has a brush and some things there. Shadows. They're kind of trying to make it look like the Urban Decay palettes, ain't they? Yes, they are. And then I also he also got me this Enchanted Eyeshadow Palette. Um... And this also has a huge mirror, and then it has all these colors along with a brush. I'm not sure if the brush... The brush is not really a good brush, but really cute. Hubby has some good taste. And then my poor, sweet, lovely husband. Um, I don't know how or why he would think for one minute. He knows I do not do my brows. I All I do is get them waxed and plucked. I do not put anything, any product on my brows. My brows are already thick and dark. So I don't put product because then I just look scary. Um, <laughs> but he got me some brow stuff. <laughs> so I'll just throw it in my makeup kit um, for when I do other people's makeup. But here is the brow kit. and But it's amazing. Like if I used this stuff, I would be like, wow. <laughs> But anyway, so you, there's a huge mirror down here, and then you get your brows in different colors. You get stencils, you get brushes, you get um, pencils, you get tweezers, you get brow gel. I mean, you get a lot of stuff in here. This is by Profusion. Not sure where he got it. He took the tag off there if there was one. And he also, you guys, got me this Tarte palette, and I love it. I've been using this every single day, basically. 
Um, I played it in a lot, but I've been using it almost every day that I've done my makeup. I love this set. It is so pigmented and so beautiful. This is probably one of their best creations with the Tarte eyeshadows, in my opinion. And I own a lot of Tarte eyeshadows. Um, you get your shadows, which as you see, I've been messing in a lot of these colors. You get, sorry, your blushes, you get your highlighter, and you also get your bronzers. And then in here, which I end up losing... Um, well, I didn't lose it, but I got it put up because I've been using it. Um, the mascara you get, you also get an eyeliner and you also get a lip gloss, which here, I'll just show you like this. You also get a lip gloss. So, and you know what? What's so funny? It got a chocolate smell to it. It almost smells like Too Faced palettes. Every time I open this, I'm like, I'm smelling chocolate. Yeah, it's this. It smells like chocolate. I think they're trying to copy, but it smells good. So, love this palette. Thank you, hubby. <laughs> okay. So, nextly, this huge bag of makeup here. Um, he also picked me up, which I don't see a price on it. Oh, I do. $3.99. Um, he picked this up. Oh, TJ Maxx. $3.99 and this is a pimple extractor now he knows I use these he hates when I pick up my face and I have a huge phobia with pimples being on my face and then they get big or they dry out and all this stuff so I always like try to extract them and I try to use extractors because in my past I started getting blemish scars because of squeezing and stuff you just damage the skin around and that's what causes the scar so um, I was happy to see that he got me an extractor like if you're going to pick pop them, you do it right. He also got me these earrings. I'm not sure where he got these and there's no price on them. I didn't even ask him, so I don't know. But he got me them earrings. Um, And such a sweetheart. He knows I use these every time I do my makeup. Um, it doesn't say where he got it from but anyway um this is called studio dry every time i do my makeup i use these on my head and this is the most cutest adorable one um he picked up for me so i absolutely love it and he got it in pink <laughs> um he also picked up this 100 percent argan beauty oil he's like i don't know what this is about he's like but it said beauty oil so i figured you might want to try it so he grabbed this and he got this actually from TJ Maxx and it was $5.99. So I'm going to give it a try. Of course I am. Hubby, hubby bought it for me. Why wouldn't I? <laughs> and then he also picked up this Advanced <clears throat> Clinicals Vitamin C Serum. Um, it's And you guys, I have been using this on my face daily. I use it every night when I wash my face. I use it, I put it on, then I put a moisturizer on. This stuff is absolutely amazing. I wake up feeling so vibrant, so it just, my skin has definitely did something different, done something different since I've been using this. And this is the vitamin C serum. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so try that out. And you guys, yes, he got me my chocolate bell palette. And I seen, I cannot remember, who was it? Who was it? Lauren Wesley. I seen her post it on um, Instagram and I was going to leave that day to go get that sucker. I was like, I'm going to get it. And I winded up not getting it. I didn't. But I'm glad I didn't because hubby did. So I'm glad I did not get it. Um, but I was excited to have it and very grateful and it's just so beautiful and i will show you the colors inside so it got a huge mirror of course like all of their chocolate bar palettes and it has all these gorgeous colors the only one i can say that i'm not too fond with is this pink one up here i'm not really too fond with it to me it's patchy and it does not let off a lot of power so i'm going to keep playing in them and seeing what kind of looks i can come up with but i'm not really feeling the um the pink in there at all <clears throat> oh my leg is starting to fall asleep y'all because i'm like sitting on it okay i gotta move some of this thing. and i'm moving you while i'm doing it ain't I? okay <laughs> okay so also he got me he got me this uh what is it called makeup setting spray of course by urban decay i've been using the heck out of this almost every application of makeup 
and it just looks like this it has two caps and of course you just pump 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 so he got me one of these and i've been using it <laughs> he also got me the fenty highlight and i got it in the color lighting dust and fire crystal lightning dust and fire crystal which it is these gorgeous colors i wasn't too keen on the gold you know that gold one that she has i'm not really big on putting all that gold stuff on my face it's just to me it's unnatural and i think a nice highlight like this color is great but i i just think it's unnatural with that, all that gold stuff so yeah he got me that oh my leg is really bothering me um and i picked these up myself these are just hair clips I don't know why I even throw them in here, um, but they're huge hair clips, the bendable ones, and I just thought they'd be cute if I wanted to like pull my hair back, um, so I grabbed these myself. I don't even remember where I bought them. <laughs> and then he also got me this Vitamin Infused Complexion Prep Spray. Um, it is vitamin infused, which I love this stuff. It's so refreshing. I'm actually going to put some on now. I love it. It's, <laughs> I'm making crazy faces. Sorry, guys. But it's so refreshing, and I've been using this a lot also. And I picked this up. This is a lip color gloss, Nika K. $2.99 I paid for it at the um, beauty supply. And that is this color right here. Yes, I'm already ahead of it. Y'all already did some swatches on some of the stuff. <laughs> and you guys, I was like my darling... He knows me. He loves me. Um, he picked up these. Where's the other one? It might be in the other bag. So guess what? You guys got to wait on that one. Uh, <laughs> he picked up these um, MAC uh, Pro Long Wear Paint Pots. Not sure where he got them. Probably Sephora, Alter, MAC Store, wherever. <clears throat> um... He also got me this Too Faced 24 hour eyeliner. No tag. He must have got it from one of them stores. And then, bless his sweetheart, he got me another eyebrow thing. I don't, I don't put nothing on my eyebrows. I go on my kit too. Oh yeah, here's an, one of them butter things that I told you. I don't know, is this color in here? Yes, it's this color. So I did purchase this before I got this set. So yeah guys it is amazing amazing um let me see i know i'm probably making a mess but it is so rich and buttery so beautiful <laughs> but anyways he also picked up some of these little um eye eyeshadows I should have asked him where he got these because these are gorgeous. And they're swirl colors. So you can blend and mix them. They're so pretty. And they're cute. And he got me three of them. In three different shades. So there's this one. There's the purple one. And then there's the green and orange looking one. So them are so cute. <clears throat> um, I don't know why that's even in there. He also got me the Clarisonic, which I am so stoked about. I've been using it, and oh my god, I did go through a purge phase. If you guys don't know what the purge phase is, please go on YouTube and look it up. Look up the purge purge from the Clarisonic. I had a breakout, but it got better over time. The breakout lasted a while for me, I'm not going to lie. I had a breakout, especially on my cheek area, especially on this side, but it did get better as time went on, and I love it. And to take off makeup is crazy crazy amazing i'm telling you the truth i picked this up myself at walgreen around the same time i pick up the other glosses this is by maybelline and i'm not gonna lie to you i'm not too amazed by these they're more glossy than color you know like when you look at how vibrant these colors are you think it's going to be like a lot a color like how this is well it's not it's more sheer most of the colors are more sheer than they should be so not too big on this, but, you know, it's a gloss. 
Also, hubby got me two Michael Kors hats. Oh, I didn't even want to touch that. He got me this one, which I have worn already once or twice. And it's like a beanie. And then he also got me this one, this Michael Kors hat. And how much was this? $38. This one has the thing on there still. Um, it says Michael Kors right here. And it's so soft and cozy. So I'm going to wear this um, hopefully before the winter ends. Or I might wear it next year. I might just save it. You know what I mean? <laughs> Oh, there was another pair of shoes from Ashley Stewart. Now, when he got me these, TMI, but he's like, these are going to look so sexy on your legs. But <laughs> on your big old thick legs, that's what he said. Um, but yeah, so I like that the heel's not too crazy because mama ain't like I used to be back in the day when I was thinner, when I was younger, and I didn't care if my feet hurt. I just wanted to be cute. No. I'm grown up from that. <laughs> I'm a clog, um, small heel, um, wedge type of girl nowadays. I don't do the crazy heels unless they're block heels and it's not too narrow. No, not too much of a slope. But these are so gorgeous. They're like gladiator shoes and they are so pretty. I tried them on and I absolutely love them. So I guess you want to see my legs in them. <laughs> That'd be crazy. And then he also got me this brush set. I don't, don't even ask me where because there's no tag on here. I, oh, I tried to figure it out and I was going to ask him. And every time I went to go ask him, I forgot all about it. And I wanted to know because I was actually going to go purchase again, purchase myself one, another one, because I love the look of these things. And I don't even want to use them because they're so beautiful. But obviously it was a Christmas set. And... <sighs> I don't even want to use them. Look at these. Look at these gorgeous things. Ugh. So, yeah. They are beautiful. Wherever he got them, they might not even be available anymore because it looks like it was a Christmas get, Christmas packet. So, this at my sale. Well, when I say I picked stuff up, you guys, it was with some of my Christmas money. So, I did still get this around Christmas time. Um, Because I got gifts and I got money. But anyway... I picked this up because I am so into the rose gold. This is for my desk. Um, I actually been transitioning into the rose gold look on my desk. So I thought this plant was such a cute addition. I think I paid $7.99 for this. Um, no, it was originally $7.99 and I got it on clearance, I think, for $4.99. So it's super cute. I love it. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. And hubby got me this, which I, it was so funny because I didn't even really look at, I had so much stuff to unwrap and unload that I didn't even really get a good chance to look at this. And I absolutely like this. This is by Profusion. It's the Studio Highlight Six Luminous um, Strobe Powders. And I didn't even get a chance to look at it. I was just like, oh, that's so beautiful. And I, I didn't, I don't even remember looking at it that, gr that good. <laughs> but as I swatched them, I was like, wow, them are so pretty. Look at those, these two fingers, so pretty. I'm like, oh, can't wait to play in these. So thank you, hubby. <laughs> yeah, he thought of everything when it came to the makeup. He really did. And some of the things I think he might've had my daughter, my oldest daughter with him. Um, and she probably helped him pick out some stuff. That's normally what he does. They think they're slick, but I know. <laughs> A lot of times they'd be acting like they're going somewhere else and that's probably what they're doing. Um, ultra soft luxury nylon brush this is um circle stamp makeup brush and i'm not sure how much he paid for this or where he got it from but it looks pretty cool i would open it up but my video is getting too long as it is so um if you want to see that just let me know he also picked me up this mac um brush and it looks like he left the sticker on because it was pretty glued on there and he probably would have tore so he just left it on there. He got this from Nordstrom's Rack. It says $9.97 he paid for it. And then, you guys, I swear by this stuff. I buy it all the time. So I am so glad he bought me a backup. This is why I haven't used this one. Because I already have one that I'm using. But this is the Elizabeth Arden Eye Renewal Cream. And you guys, I use this day and night. When I go to bed, after washing my face and put my moisturizer on, I put my eye cream on. And when I wake up and I wash my face, I put my eye cream on. And Elizabeth Arden has one of the best eye creams, I swear. I love it. You know, when you're getting older, you gotta, you're never too young to start like using 
good creams and eye creams and stuff because you want to you don't want to have to correct you want to prevent so never too never too young also picked me up this 100% um, natural um, oil and this is aromatherapy pillow mist it's called rise and shine I haven't used it yet but I'm going to <laughs> he also got me this um, girl keep it clean makeup brush cleanser I thought this was so adorable because it got like this little pump I didn't open it yet the plastic's still on it but I guess you just pump it that's so adorable love it yeah, he got me two of these by the way um he also got me um this tart high performance naturals um amazonian clay full coverage foundation broad spectrum spf 15 sunscreen um this is foundation and then he got me the brush now i know them girls at the store tricked him into that they're probably like oh this goes hand in hand with this i can guarantee it because he wouldn't have thought of this i don't think well he might have he thinks of everything who knows but they probably did that um or my daughter did but i always wanted to play um uh use this um airbrush uh finishing bamboo uh, foundation brush and i'm gonna tell you the truth about this you guys i don't know what the hype is like this is why i never jump on the bandwagon anymore on youtube about beauty gurus and stuff doing their makeup like oh this is great this is great this is great uh-uh i unless i try it out in the store myself i am i'm not even gonna i'm not gonna order it online unless i've tried it because i've noticed that a lot of the things are not just as great as people say and i'm gonna tell you like if it wasn't for him getting this for me i would never have purchased this um i tried it in the store and I was like, hmm, I didn't put it on my face because I don't know how many people sampled that. But I did brush it on my hand. And I'm like, hmm, I was skeptical. But you never know when you put foundation on it how it's going to be. Well, I put foundation on it since he bought it for me and tried it. And I don't know what the hype is. To me, it's no different than any other fluffy brush, foundation fluffy brush. It's no, they, they call it airbrush. No, it's not. No, it's not. Don't buy it. Save your $39 or $36, whatever it is. I can't remember. Save it. Don't buy it. It's not even worth it. I'm honest. I'm honest. Okay. <laughs> and then um, I purchased this myself. This is actually something I bought from the beauty supply. It is a matte lip gloss. And this is actually the color right here. It is very smooth and soothing. Lightweight on the lips. And you can't even tell you have anything on your lips. I promise you, I am not lying. So if you ever see this, I don't even know the brand. It's so small. If you ever see this at your local beauty supply, snap a picture. <laughs> Try it because it's really good. Really good. Okay. He also got me this urban decay not sure we got it tags not on it probably sephora alta urban decay matte resolution lip gloss um looks like you broke the tag off of it so yeah i mean not lip gloss did i say lip gloss lipstick <laughs> it's a matte lipstick it is pink like the color of the box and he also got me which i am stoked about he also got me these. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Let me just show you this first so I can get it out the way. <laughs> um, he got me this Too Faced lipstick. It's the color that's on this package. Too Faced lip cream, whatever. I'm just so excited to get to these. These, <laughs> these are the Stila um, uh, Metal uh, Glitter and Gloss Liquid Eyeshadow and Glow Liquid Eyeshadow. And that is this one here and this one here. And this one is called Rose Gold Retro. And the other one is called, I think it's Smoldering Satin, which is this one. They are so beautiful, you guys. And I was like, hubby, you know what? Let's get married again. Let's get married all over again, okay? We're just going to go do it. Let's just go get married again. <laughs> He's perfect. Like, he really is perfect as far as, like, he knows me so well. He knows what I like. He knows what I need. And, well, I don't need, but he knows me. 
Okay, so yeah, another brow gel, which of course I don't do my brows, so that go in my makeup kit. But that was amazing for hubby to even think of me like that. Um, I bought this myself, and this is a candy jar that I'm well, I'm, I'm gonna be using it as a candy jar on my desk, and it goes hand in hand with my little plant. <laughs> My little tiny plant. Okay, also, I don't even know where the other one went, but there was three of these. Hmm, I just had it and I don't know what I do with it. But anyways, these are the Kat Von D. I'm sure he got these from TJ Maxx. The stickers ain't on there, he tore them off. But I'm sure he got them from TJ Maxx because I showed him they were at TJ Maxx when I seen them on Instagram, so he probably went there and just grabbed them. But anyway... I'm sure that's where he got them from. I'm almost definitely definitely sure. Hopefully he did because if he paid full price for them somewhere else, he crazy. <laughs> oh, and he got me the Fenty. I've been tearing this down, y'all. Tearing it down. I've been using it like constantly. And like, I even lost the cat, the cat. But let me tell you a little something like this. At first, I had a love-hate with this. To be honest with you, um, at first, when I first got it, I loved it then a couple more uses I was like this is not doing for me it just looked patchy blotchy drying mattifying and I didn't like it well what it really was is my skin was going through something and it was drying out a lot so that was causing the makeup obviously to look dry on your face because it is like more of a mattifying type um foundation well also so now I'm loving it because I've been like really doing a lot of moisturizing and deep cleaning to my face also, um, if you buy it, like right now, I'm in 310. If you buy it, make sure you have it tested at Sephora. Have them test it on you and sit there for at least 10 minutes. Wait till it completely dries because this does darken up. Because when I first put this on my face, as you see, it kind of looks more yellow, but it darkens up on my face. So this does darken up. Just I keep saying that, but truthfully, it does. So just make sure that you um wait before you make a decision um so yeah these are the Kat Von D I have three of my all three colors but the other one I don't even know where it's at somewhere around here <laughs> it's somewhere around here is it in here no it's not I don't know where it's at did I clear all the bags? I don't know where it's at. You guys, I'm so sorry, but you guys get the point. He also got me this microphone, you guys. I am a diehard karaoke -er. See that karaoke machine back there? I am a diehard karaoke -er, and my microphones keep breaking. So that's because I'm a diehard karaoke -er. Yeah, so he ended up getting me another microphone. Um, I just needed to replace the one because the other one's still working. But this is the Singing Machine Creations Joys Through Music. And it is amazing and awesome. And I cannot wait to use this one. It also comes with a little adapter just in case. So, love it. Some people want to put it on their um, computer. All right. This came with the Fenty when he bought it. I used one of them. But the other colors are not me, I guess. <laughs> And ah, my leg, my leg. Let me show you what my oldest daughter got me for Christmas. I'm going to show you a picture of one of the items. I'm going to try and get it over here, but it's very big. So she got me this headband, which is a jeweled headband. Really cute. She also got me these two brush cleaners for my makeup kit. She's such a sweet doll. So what it is, is it's an armband. So some people buy the little tray thing, but it's more difficult to use than something that's right there at your exposure. This does stretch, it has bands, so it can go up further and further if you want it to. And then it comes with a brush also. And you just do this every time you're doing your client's makeup. You just kind of clean it off. Um, I would probably wear it on this arm because I'm left-handed, so I could just do 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 So every time you clean your client, you want your client's brushes to be clean at all times, right? And so you're not double dipping into your eyeshadows and all that stuff. So love it. Comes with two-sided brush. And that just slides right up into these little this little holder. And yeah, guys. So she got me two of those. You guys don't remind my eczema. It's my eczema. My eczema. Eczema? 
people say it differently. But anyway, um, I only get it on my one arm. Nowhere else on my body. Just this arm. That's it. But she got me two. Okay, so also she, um, she got me these. Um, or sorry, she got me. I picked up these uh, base coat sugar polish and vitamin E sugar polish. And I thought these were so adorable. So I picked these up for myself. I thought they were so cute. And <clears throat> let me just try to get this item over here she bought me. Now the one item I'm definitely going to have to show you a little picture. And then I'm going to have to show you a manufacturer picture of it. Because I cannot carry that. And I have not set it up in my room yet. But it is one of my biggest Christmas gifts that I got from hubby. And I want to show you guys. But I can't. Obviously I can't carry it right. So. It, well you'll see why. <laughs> but I'm going to show you guys in a picture. I have a little picture of it. Of what I can show you. And then I'll show you the manufacturer picture. So you can see the whole thing. But anyways. So this is another item that my baby girl got me. She got me my train case. And I am so excited about this. I was so excited about this. I needed, and this is the four in one. It has a lot of room. It has keys to every single compartment. Oh, you guys, I'm so excited about this. So I'm going to show you. I have to open this because there's something in here that she purchased also. She also got me some a starter kit of my applicators. So she got me the mascara and then also the eyeliner and the lipstick ones. So, oh, isn't that cute? And you get a ton of them. So I am so, it's 150, 150 pieces are in here so it's a lot so I'm excited you guys I got a lot of stuff for Christmas she also got me this mirror right here I'm not going to show you because I don't want to blind you but what it does is you can either do this so your clients can hold it and see their beautiful face or you can set it up on a thing like this so they can look at themselves but to, to be honest with you never have well I'm not going to say never do but if you have complaining customers, do not let them sit in front of a mirror because they're going to be like, well, what about this? Well, what about that? What about that? Before you even get finished the job and it's going to frustrate you and then you're going to have an attitude and try to keep it inside, but you're really going to want to cuss them out. So just to save that, don't have a mirror until you're done. When you're done, hand them one of these and let them look. Okay. Until then, don't let them see themselves. Okay. <laughs> So you can sit this on the desk in front of them if you want them to see themselves while you're doing their makeup. Or you can just let them see it after the fact. But this she got for me to put in the train case that she bought me. So my daughter's so sweet. Just like her poppy. Okay. So that is everything in my video. As I said, I will leave some pictures. Even the items that I was not able to show you because I, I did get um, a Michael Kors coat for Christmas and I also got a coat from Ashley Stewart's for Christmas but it's going to be hard because they're huge coats and it's going to be hard to show you so I will show you pictures of the models wearing them so you'll know exactly which ones I have and I will show you a picture of my biggest gift that I got for Christmas in a picture after the video. Okay so I will see you guys later. Stay tuned for them photos. Bye bye.